factors and multiples. Multiples are the numbers we get when we multiply a whole number with another whole number. Multiples are basically the answers to your times tables. Factors are the two numbers we multiply together to give another number. Factors are also the numbers that we use to divide another number by, leaving no remainders. There are two ways we can work out the factors of a number, either by multiplying or dividing. For example, 2 and 3 multiply together to give us 6. We would describe 2 and 3 as factors of 6. We can also say that 6 is a multiple of 2 and 3. 6 also has more factors. For example, we can multiply 1 and 6 together to give 6. Therefore, 1 and 6 are also factors of 6. 6 has four factors, 2, 3, 1 and 6. There are no other numbers that multiply together to make 6. You can also work out factors by dividing. We can divide 6 by 2 to give 3 or the reverse. Therefore, 2 and 3 are factors of 6. We can also divide 6 by 1 to give 6 or the reverse. So 1 and 6 are also factors of 6. Some numbers such as 24 have 8 factors, while larger numbers such as 60, 70, 84 and 96 have as many as 12 factors. It is also important to note that 2 is always a factor for any even number. As you can see, 2 is a factor for 2, 4, 6, 8, 10 and 12, and this continues for all even numbers. Looking back at our factors, we can see that there are many numbers which only have 2 factors. Here we can see that 2, 3, 5, 7, 11 and 13 all only have two factors, which are always themselves in one. We can take a look at this chart and see all the numbers up to 100 that only have two factors, themselves in one. These numbers are important and we call them prime numbers. It is important to note that 1 has only one factor and therefore is not a prime number.